Good morning, folks. Fam and I up in San Antonio, Texas today, and we heard about Heroes and Fantasies, a major awesome comic shop, so we're going to get down and check it out. Here we go. It's a big building. I'm really excited to get in here and check out uh, everything they have to offer. So let's go inside. Howdy, guys. How's it going? Oh, yeah, it's huge. There is a ton of toys. Right as you walk in, here's some really cool dorbs. I love this taco truck, Deadpool. <laughs> it's hilarious. More pops, really cool cable, more uh, Diamond Select. Very nice. Looks like the prices are really uh, reasonable also. Some really cool uh, posters here. They got some clothes. It's a, it's a massive building. Let's go ahead and a little more looks twisted, like we got a ton of, of uh, Diamond Select here. Marvel Legends. They got all the vintage cards mostly. I can see a couple of uh, Legends that I do need, but these are retail price. Those real cool giant uh, Secret Wars figures are nice. Some of these are like 12 bucks. Some of these uh, older Toy Biz. That is awesome. I dig this one. Very nice. Oh, yeah, check this. <laughs> the big old flies riding. That's cool. Ant-Man. That's a good one. And the more... I definitely need that blade. I mean, uh, the... The other guy. Bullseye. So, that's cool. A retro-looking Stan Lee. I like that. That's nice. I need it. If he had his glasses, I'd probably take it. I like those zombie... Sabretooth's really, really cool. Storm, Drax. We got some DC, got some multiverse. Some Diamond Select Ghostbusters, really cool. Here's a Muppets. <clears throat> DC Direct, these are nice, these. Definitely cool. Oh, the Colossus is great. 24 bucks, not bad. Some of the larger figures. Nothing I'm looking for right now in multiverse. Yeah, good. Thank you. A lot of selection. And this one is nice. Definitely dig that swamp thing. Very cool. We got some NECA here. Robocop. That's cool. This is cheap too. It's not a bad price. Definitely, this is the newer Robocop figure. Some of these are really, really cool. Nothing I can afford right now, but definitely want to get on to these eventually. I want to come back here when I can. See anything like? Move it, girl. Move it. No. I said this isn't Some retro cards. Oh, uh, yeah, that's kind of a <laughs> throwback. Yeah, they look kind of funny. not into this Power Rangers yeah. oh that's a cool uh, Batman that's it. mannequin there. definitely cool some Star Wars Rebels I like these animated looking Rebels it's a lot of 90s figs too some black series prices are pretty good gotta find the clearance aisle some turtles these look like a little bit older turtles too not vintage but not brand new I don't like the new style Star Trek here. Still trying to put my Star Trek, uh, all the series together, Deep Space Nine, Voyager, Enterprise, TOS. I want to get all them and put them, the teams together, captains and the medicals, the chief medical officers, science officer, security, and get every one of them together. Next generation. They got some good ones here for down to like five bucks, which is a good deal. Definitely dig a lot of these guys. Yeah, this one's nice. Totally uh, dig all these. They got a pretty good uh, selection here of 
late 90s also and new stuff so that's really awesome some really cool uh wrestlers wrestling figures tv sports some of those retro action figures breaking bad definitely cool mcfarland uh, simpsons definitely cool kind of put my simpsons together slowly i'm not in a hurry to put anything together completely because we're gonna collect for the rest of our lives yeah. <laughs> but really cool also i have quite a few now oh we got some pretty cool NECA heroes kick-ass movie was good lord of the rings very cool definitely like all of these these are really niche figs you can't find at some of our retail stores so kind of nice rick and morty masters of the universe very cool these are a little pricier some newer gi joe stuff awesome definitely dig it this place is loaded it's got so many comics look at this spider-man is awesome <laughs> it's the new suit the Civil War suit. It's cool. And they got a lot of books. Oh, look at these statues. These are amaze balls and awesome sauce. <laughs> Man, look at these guys. They look amazing. This Stan Lee is incredible. Wow. Hulk. They got it all here. Look at these huge red Hulks. So nice. I would never have room for any of this. Huh? <laughs> like it? Wow, check this out. Yeah, you'll go ahead and wait for me, I'll be right out. Amazing. Plus hot toys. <laughs> this stuff is top shelf. I'm glad it's not on the top shelf. Superman is amazing. Definitely dig all the Power Girls, Supergirls. This Lobo, wow, incredible. Very cool Lobo. Joker, one of my favorite villains. Very good looking. Some sweet Bandai turtles. Look at these weapons to decorate a collection room. Incredible. Oh yeah. It's very nice. Star Wars, look at these massive Star Wars figures. It's pretty awesome. Can't beat that. Batmobile's dope. A lot of DC villains here. Harley, the beautiful Harley, the infamous Harley Quinn. Pudding, love it. Oh, look at this guy. Big Bad Bane. More statues. Top shelf stuff. Incredible. Man, like now we're getting into a ton more shelves. Looks like we got a lot of collectibles and pops coming up. Oh, wow. That is awesome. What do you think? I like it. I think it's cool. I like it. Big Bad Deadpool, very cool looking statue. Glasses. Look at this vintage, now we're talking G1s. Look at this, this right here is my gold. Look at that, Destructicons. Look at the collection, it's ridiculous. Some old 80s stuff, love it. Incredible. Amazing, amazing stuff. See Unicron. Look at these turtles. Ooh. You can find me more carded turtles. Godzilla. Terminator, more turtles, more turtles. Beautiful, look at that, all vintage. I want every single thing there. Even if I have it already, I would take it. What's in here? Vintage 
Star Wars ships. More Star Wars stuff. Very sweet. Sweet little collection here. Definitely digging it. Voltron. Wow. Moving into G.I. Joe's. Definitely loving this. All these 80s Joe's are just great memories right now. Definitely sweet. Look at all this. Dang. I love these Joe uh, vehicles. They always made the best. Look at these down here. And the prices aren't bad. I'm going to have to come back another time and buy a bunch of vintage stuff. Like drop 100 bucks on them. 200 bucks, just all vintage. Pops, more shirts, more clothing. A lot of collectibles. Big Bad Thanos, it's a real cool cutout. Really loving these older Star Wars pop figs. This guy's crazy. Sorry about the glare though. Really digging these figures. Probably super pricey. Very, very dope. Gorgeous. Look at that. Some really cool NECA here. It's a lot of Terminator stuff. These vintage aliens figures. I have this one loose from my buddy David. It's not a bad price carded though. Maybe one day I'll take it. Smurfs, very cool older Smurfs. Definitely stuff I like to get loose, but these are cool. Definitely cool. Some more Star Wars. A lot of older 90s Star Wars. Some aliens, and these are great. Look at these alien Marines. The big ass predator. Beautiful. Beautiful. Power Rangers. Loving these. Very cool. More Star Wars. Some good ones here, too. Definitely, definitely love General Grievous, Greedo, and great ones. Luke, Pilot. Some of the 90s figures. I got that uh, Jawa there, it's a good one. Got some Spawn stuff, I got a lot of Spawn stuff myself. These are good prices. Definitely good prices. Don't see a lot of these back home, so kind of cool to see a big old collection of them. A lot of stuff. Check that out. This right here is like grails for me, the Technodrome. And the sewer play set and the van, the TMNT van, even that uh, hot air balloon. Definitely grills. Love some of this old TMNT stuff. Look how great that is. One day, one day. I think I had the Technodrome once, and when I was younger, of course, I haven't picked it up again yet. Some great stuff here. Some of the vehicles too, quite a few of the turtle vehicles. What's up folks, Kevin here, AKA the Tattoo Toy Hunter, coming to you today with a quick recap on my trip over to San Antonio, Texas and to Heroes and Fantasies. That place was awesome. And uh, I'm so glad I got to go. I wanna go back because they had a ton of vintage and I wasn't really financially ready for all the sea and all that. But uh, we did have a blast. It was my wife's birthday. So I wanna give a shout out to my beautiful wife. Happy birthday, dear. I hope you enjoyed uh, the game room. She loves game rooms. We So we had a fun. We were kids. <laughs> so anyway, I want to give a quick shout out to her for her birthday. Uh, 
Also, before I get into my haul, my very simple haul for today, uh, I want to go ahead and give a shout out to a gentleman. I did not get his name. This gentleman is a fellow collector like the rest of us and a viewer of my channel. And he actually recognized me at a Chinese buffet of all places there in San Antonio. Uh, I think it was called Chopsticks. It was a great place, delicious anyway. He recognized me, came up to me, shook my hand. Very nice gentleman. Very awesome, awesome guy. And uh, him and his son had just gotten out of Avengers uh, Infinity Wars. They watched the movie. And they went to eat together and he recognized me, came up and just to let, him, let me know he had been uh, viewing my channel for six months. I did not get his name though, so buddy... Uh, I would love to know your name, you know, maybe we can connect something on social media to keep up to, with each other. This is the first time this has ever happened to me. It was a real surreal moment for anybody to recognize me from the internet because I'm a very tiny channel. But uh, it was very awesome to meet a, a fellow viewer and a fellow collector out there. We're all, the, you know, we're all the same, basically. So anyway, very cool to meet you, gentlemen, that you, sir. And if you can give me a shout out here, it'd be awesome to know who you are. Anyway, this is going to be my haul, guys. This is all I picked up. This was the last thing I needed also for the Man-Thing wave. And uh, so now I can put this bad boy together. I have all of them. Except for I don't have Blade. But my buddy David Blucher gave me the part. He got Blade. He didn't need it for Man-Thing. He just wanted the character because he collects uh, Blade figures. So he gave me that part. Uh, I believe it was a leg. So I am now complete with this arm. And uh, in a separate video, I will put together Man Thing. I'm very excited to see him put together. So, this is gonna be what I picked up. Not too big a deal, I know. And I didn't get it for the cheap five bucks it was going for at Walmart's before it sold out. But I'm glad that I got it. So, as you can see, the box is perfect. And uh, able to put Man Thing together. Very excited for that, guys. So this is going to be it. I won't drag this out any longer. This is Kevin, a.k.a. the Tattoo Toy Hunter, reminding you to never give up that hunt. Pew, 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 pew. Y'all take care.